So Mark, welcome to West Bromwich Albion. Thanks very Good much. Good to see you. Um, what, tell, us, tell us about the move and how, how it came about. Uh, it came about uh, pretty quickly to be honest. Uh, obviously, I heard the interest was uh, a few days ago when obviously the chance to, to come back and play for a manager who I've got great respect for and have played under before, so that was, that was very appealing for me. Uh, and chance to move probably a bit closer home, I would imagine. Does that help? Yeah, I think I think that was that was a massive part of it. Obviously, uh, having my family up here and having a having a, a young son. Obviously, uh, I think it was, uh, it was. I think it was a bit personal for me to get back yeah. up here. And of course, yes, you're signing for Tony Pulis again. You know all about him. What tell tell us all about working for him. <laughs> I've I've had some some great experiences working under under uh, Tony over the years. Obviously, uh, he first signed me from Portsmouth. Obviously, when I when I was young, uh, my time at Stoke, I thoroughly enjoyed it. We we went to the FA Cup final, we lost, played in Europe. I've got I've got so many good memories over the years. But now he was he was a he was a great guy, and I always thought highly of him. So you're not too surprised to be joining West Bromwich Albion, eighth in the Premier League, and really looking as if they're on the march again. Uh, they've been looking terrific this year. From what I've, any time I've seen them on the telly, you know, uh, they're in a good position in the league. You know, I think they've got some terrific players at the club now. Players that I look forward to to playing with and obviously getting involved with. So that's a big positive. Uh, but now they've they've done a a good job so far this year, you know, may it continue. And uh, we know that you're an adaptable player. You've mm -hmm. played across the back four and in, and in midfield. I mean, do, do you join us with that in mind to begin with, that you that you are ready to step in? Uh, yeah, that's, that's that's the thing. I mean, I can play. I'm pretty adaptable throughout my whole career. I've played, uh, I've played left back, centre back, right back, midfield. Uh, I've played all, all positions, you know. Uh, I'm happy to be at the club and and do his job if I'm required to do it. And happy to join the Irish contingent, which is growing by the <laughs> growing by each window. Yeah, definitely. I know I know quite a few of the faces in the in the change room, so yeah, it'll be good to meet up all the boys again. Now it's alone until the end of the season, yeah. um, but am I right in thinking that you would love nothing more than to do enough in the next few months to perhaps persuade West Bromwich Albion to make that permanent? Oh yeah, definitely. That's that's my goal here now. Obviously, I've, I've come here. I want to do well and succeed, you know. I think uh, obviously over the last half a year, uh, I haven't haven't been given the opportunity, you know, to play football. But I think that was a lot down to personal reasons as well, and my family uh, being so far away and uh, me not seeing them. I think it was I was a little bit I was feeling a little bit down, you know. But I'm, I've moved back up this way now, and uh, I've just. I feel happy again, you know. That bit, that spark has just come back into me.